guys, it's me, Brittany Amber, and welcome to my shoot for the Feel Stroker. <laughs> excites me the most about this product coming out is that well first of all like I'm finally getting my very own toy for everybody across the world to have so that they can fuck my pussy anytime any place that they want <laughs> it's such an awesome feeling and thought <laughs> This company actually sent a professional molder to my house, but it even sent to my house, which is amazing. And she had all kinds of things. I mean, we even did a cast of my butthole. We did two of my vagina. It really, it was a process. It was, like I said, I didn't expect half of the things that we did, but I actually have a YouTube video of the whole process. If you want to go check out my YouTube page, I mean, that would make it a lot easier. I mean, there's so much that we did. And also it took longer, or I'm sorry, shorter for the mold to even settle in this time too, because. You have to sit in a weird position with your legs back and like hold open your vagina so that it all kind of seats in and yeah. Well, just watch my YouTube channel or my YouTube video. It explains it all. <laughs> well, first and foremost, clitoral stimulation. You know, that's every girl's favorite or most girl's favorite. And <laughs> is it all sexual pleasure or just any pleasures? Dark chocolate, Pokemon Go slash Pokemon cards. And is that three? I think three. <laughs> Nothing really specific. I just get inspiration at just random times. Something will just pop in my head. I think that's how, how it is for most people, you know. I'll be watching something or see something or just hear a story or anything, you know, and uh, then I'm like, oh, well, I got an idea now, or, you know, especially since I've been doing a lot of my own content in the past year, I really keep my eyes open for inspiration <laughs> at any turn because it's all over the place. Is it supposed to be a deep question or is it more like supposed to be like, I? because I feel empowered like physically when I eat well and things like that. And shoot, like we were just talking about, I've been shooting a lot of my own content and now I have my own business and that's very, very empowering. You know, I feel like, yeah, this is the most empowered I've really ever felt in my in career. Well, my favorite song for a sexy time, and I also feature dance to this too, is called Close to You by Frank Ocean. And it is very sexy. It's a very short song, but it's a very sexy song. It is a perfect song to dance to, especially when you just want to get on the stage and off. Like, it's like a one minute, 20 seconds. <laughs> Actually, in my relationship now, he fantasizes me being the neighbor's wife and that he's like, you know, just like some, you know, like techie guy, you know, at home alone, kind of. And I don't know, I'm just, he's just like, that would be such a good fantasy, wouldn't it be? And I was like, he's like, I always think about that when we have sex. I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, I've been doing adult movies almost 13 years now. I feel like I've done it all, but I guess, I don't know if this really applies, but I, I wanna, you know, produce my own big feature or something like that. It's not really like a, a you know, a sex act, cause I have, you know what? No, cause I already done that too. No, never mind. <laughs> I was gonna say double vaginal, but um, I did do that in Europe and it was kind of like just impromptu, you know, it wasn't like an official thing. So maybe doing like an official double vag, Gosh, there's so much. Wow. Um, definitely, you know, thanks to spice up your sex life. I think a lot of people do kind of ne neglect that, you know, and kind of don't put as much importance to it as they should, you know, and I feel like, yeah, just even watching porn, you could get a lot of good ideas for that. <laughs> first and foremost is get a good agent because when I first started I didn't know anybody in the industry and I just talked to one girl that because at the time I was working at the Moonlight Bunny Ranch in Northern Nevada if you've seen the show Cat House on HBO that was where I started and so I met a girl up there who came from the industry going up there she was kind of wrapping it up you know and doing movies and that was like her ending her career there so she at the time was with an agent who I didn't know like she even told me like 
you should go with somebody else like he's just you know and I didn't know that it made any difference I'm like oh no you know just give me your guys's number it's whatever you know why does it matter but then a week and a half later you know I was put in a few really bad positions and then luckily I met shy love and she saved me and she was like you're mine now you know you have no say in this and she rescued me thank goodness and really saved me from a lot more who even knows could have happened you know Social media is probably the most important thing of my career, especially now doing my own content, being able to advertise it and promote it and being able to communicate with fans and also, you know, selling customs to fans and stuff because, um, you know, it's a direct line to, to them. But then I also tell people too, you know, it's easiest just to sub subscribe to my OnlyFans, which is also, you know, like a private social media. So it does kind of funnel down everything. So I'm able to communicate with people better in there. Um, well, the worst part is, yeah, everybody's got their opinions and everybody, especially right now, you know what I mean? Having to look at other people's garbage and stuff and also when they want to, you know, start spilling their garbage onto your stuff and I'm like, okay, <laughs> this is not the place. This is, a, this is a, a porn social media. This is like just, I mean, this is not a, a political platform. This is nothing else but that. So that's all you can expect from my social medias. Oh my gosh, it's so amazing. Like I said, that was, that was the most, uh, oh fuck, now, now I'm getting all tongue tied. Now, see how excited I am? <laughs> no, that's the most exciting part about this whole experience and this whole process is that everybody's going to be able to have a chance to fuck my pussy at any time, anywhere, any place. Ah, it's so, so exciting. I just can't wait. I can't wait to hold it in my hands. <laughs> I can't wait to finger it myself. <laughs> Oh, I have thought about that. And what I had concluded to was definitely uh, ordering a custom video where I'm talking to, cause like in my customs, I do talk to the guys. I'm like, oh yeah, Jerry, you like that? You like the way I stroke it? Let me suck it, da -da -da, whatever, you know? And uh, so if I'm there talking straight to you, giving you a J-O-I, encouraging you, and it's, it'll be just almost like the real thing. <laughs> Oh, well, for anybody using my stroker out there, I hope that I'm a good fuck. <laughs> I hope my pussy feels great wrapped around your big hard cock.